Hey, what's going on? I'm Zach Coops, and you're watching this week's episode of the Weekly Beatdown on CanadianBeats.ca. Be sure to go check us out for all sorts of Canadian music coming out all the time, but that's it. This is the intro for this week's episode. Nothing special going on, but we got lots of cool music coming up right here, so let's check it out. Check it, check it out? Check it out. Whatever, this is the intro. We interrupt this program to bring you an important message. <laughs> What's going on everybody? We're back and this is the episode. We're going to be kicking things off here in December with the very first episode with only 19 days left till Christmas. Holy smokes! I put my Amazon order in, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay, okay. I think we're good. We're good. But this is how the show works. We're going to be featuring two awesome songs for you, the fans, to vote for over on that lovely website. You guessed it. It's CanadianBeats.ca right there. You better go check it out. Link's in the description down below and you can go check out the link in my bio on Instagram if you guys want to get your votes in for this week's episode. But the song counting with the most votes by the end of the week is going to be moving on to the next round of the beatdown, baby. And in case I uh, wasn't very clear last week, if you guys are putting your votes in, be sure to hit that anonymous vote button to make sure you get your votes in because otherwise it tells you you have to sign up for something and you don't want to sign up for anything, you just want to put your votes in, okay? Just get your votes in, please. But that is going from Monday to Saturday night, so be sure to get your votes in over on the website Canadian Beats through the link in the description down below or the link on Instagram, like I said, over on my bio. But since it's the first episode before Christmas, we might as well uh, get a little festive going on in here. What the? How are you? Anyway, uh, we've also got Zach's Picks of the Week coming up as well. These are going to be recommendations that I have picked for you guys from the website Canadian Beats, so go check them out as well. But let's get right into the two awesome songs this week, facing off. Beat down! Welcome back, everybody, to the Weekly Beatdown. We're kicking things off with our reigning champions once again who have been absolutely killing it. I am telling you, they have been killing it with the voting. Of course, we're talking about Toronto, Ontario alternative rockers, The Midnight Echo, with their song, Carbon Coffee, which is coming off of their latest EP, Dichotomy. You can go check it out now on all your favorite streaming services as well. But this is going to mark the band's fifth week in a row here on the Beatdown, which means they've only got one more week to go before they might possibly be inducted to the Weekly Beatdown Hall of Fame. So you, the fans at home, better get your votes in over on the website but we're going to check out a clip right here from their song Carbon Copy, which is up to bat here on the Weekly Beatdown once again. Cause you're another carbon copy of the same damn thing. Every single day I hear sirens ring. And now I'll never be the one to call you home. Just shut up and let it all go. Cause you're another carbon copy of the same damn thing. Every single day I hear the sirens ring. And now I'll never be the one to call. But that is going to be a clip from our reigning champs, The Midnight Echo, and their song, Carbon Copy, which is coming off their latest EP, Dichotomy. Be sure to head on over to the website, Canadian Beats, to get your votes in, and check out their latest EP on all your favorite streaming services now. But now it's time to check in with our brand new competition joining us this week here on The Beatdown. He's an amazing country artist that I just discovered the other day. Hailing all the way from Charlottetown, Prince Edward Island, we have got classic Canadian country singer-songwriter Scott Mackay with his brand new title track off of his upcoming album, which is scheduled to be released on January 8th 2021 it is called stupid cupid certainly a change of pace from what we've had previously on the beatdown but when i heard stupid cupid i just thought you know what this is a great song we got to feature it here on the beatdown this week so it's up to all you country music fans out there if you want to see scott mckay's brand new song stupid cupid head on to the next round of the beatdown you better get your votes in over on the website canadian beats through the link in the description down below but now without further ado this is going to be stupid cupid right here on the weekly beatdown by our new competition scott mckay awesome songs that you guys are voting for this week so be sure to get those votes in over on the website canadianbeats.ca links in the description down below from monday to saturday nights when you got to get them in by and also we've got these recommendations that i have picked for you as well this week here on zach's picks of the week so let's check them out all all out here check them all out here man i really can't say check out here this week anyway four recommendations let's check them out 
Starting us off at number four on Zach's Picks of the Week this week, we have got a very talented Canadian-born rock pop artist who goes by the name of Margo, and she has just unveiled her new single, Someone Else, along with the lyrical video for the release. Quoted in our article over on Canadian Beats, someone else is inspired by the internal battles of oneself and their anxieties. Be sure to go check out the full article over on Canadian Beats, and be sure to go check out Margo's brand new song, Someone Else, available on all your favorite streaming services now. But we're checking out this new song right here at number four. Coming up at number three on Zach's Picks of the Week, we've got the brand new single release from the very talented Canadian indie pop singer-songwriter Astra Tintin. The new symphonic single, Better Off, is coming off of her debut forthcoming album, From My Eyes, and is available now on all streaming services, so be sure to go check out Better Off now, and be sure to go check out the full article over on Canadian Beats to check out a little bit more about her upcoming album. But we're gonna check out this clip right here on Zach's Picks of the Week at number three. Number two this week on my picks of the week goes out to a good friend of mine all the way out in Toronto, Ontario. Grunge, trap, alternative hip hop rocker Crossed Out has just dropped his symphonic album Phone Calls with Ghosts. He recently dropped the video for the first song off the album called Intro Preface, which we're going to be checking out a clip of right here on Zach's Picks of the Week at number two. But you guys better go check out the full video over on the website and go and check out the article over on Canadian Beats for my boy Crossed Out. And of course, check out his new album Phone Calls with Ghosts available on all your favorite streaming platforms. Now let's check out my boy crossed out in the brand new video for the song intro preface right here on Zach's picks of the week at number two Securing the number one spot on Zach's Picks of the Week this week, we have got Toronto, Ontario-based artist Dylan Gray, who has just unveiled her new single, Listen to the Thunder, from her upcoming album, Disappointment Girl. Surprising, this track was not born in today's gloomy atmosphere, but a few years ago when Dylan hit emotional rock bottom and began to fight back. This is why the new single, Listen to the Thunder, feels so disturbing, and the video alternates between black and white and red, which means it hints at hope. We had an amazing Five Christian interview done with Miss Gray over on Canadian Beats, if you guys want to go check it out, and of course, be sure to go check out her song, Listen to the Thunder, available now on all streaming services, but we're going to check out a clip right here at number one on Zach's Picks of the Week with the new single. Gonna be the recommendations people i hope you guys enjoyed them but if you didn't you still can go check out canadian beats for even more content like that all the time over on the website canadianbeats.ca links are all in the description down below hit us up on your favorite social medias like facebook twitter instagram but you know what else is going to help you at home you hit the subscribe button and punch that notification bell right in the dinger hit the like button send this off to your favorite friends as always because it is a proven fact that if you do all of these things you will be a happier person, or you will make me a happier person. But either way, it's the holidays. Be sure to make people happy. But that is my time for this week's episode, so I hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to hit us up on all your favorite social medias like Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Mine are all linked to the description down below as well. I just dropped a song called Valley. Go check it out. Spin that thing around and around and around. Just like the train going around the Christmas tree. Yeah. That's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace, love, and good music. I'll see you all in the next one. And as always, spread some love out there. Be nice or else you're naughty, and if you're naughty, and you're getting coal in your stocking. I've actually never gotten coal in my stocking, to be honest, I've always been a nice kid. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, bye!